Nathan, another game seven. This is not new to you, but playing here and teaming up with Jonah Heim, what was the plan to keep them off the board? Yeah, I mean, it, the plan didn't really change too much from what we had initially came in with. Uh, I think, if anything, I was a little erratic from the get-go, uh, trying to do too much. And once I was able to settle in, I thought Jonah did a great job of navigating me through that first, the first two innings. And you know, once I kind of got my composure and settled in, I felt like we were able to get some quick outs and try to go out there and go as long as we can in the game. High leverage moments calls for big time guys. You have them on the back end. They don't get enough credit. What do you think of them and what they did? I mean, they were outstanding. Sports came in and picked me up in a big situation. He got a huge strikeout of Alvarez the next inning. And then Pico comes in and does an outstanding job. I mean, traffic in there and uh, bases loaded. He gets a big strikeout and then another out. So uh, kept the game right there. And I think there's that's why we were able to answer back right there. Final question, and that's about nerves. You guys did not seem nervous going in. Do you think that may change in a winner take all game? I don't think so. I mean, I think that's the message is make sure that we're playing our game. You know, we obviously everybody knows it's game seven and it's must win to go to the World Series. But we come in and play the way we did today. We shouldn't have a problem with that. And especially with Scherz on the mound, he sets the tone and go out there and, you know, execute pitches. Nathan, thank you and congrats. Thank you. Appreciate it.